Well, a while back, we interviewed Dick Vermeil. Um, he's a very humble man. He's a very nice man. But what was he... What was it like playing for him? Is he as intense as he appears to be? Oh, oh my God. You know, I I, I forgot I, I forgot his intensity until he just got inducted into the NFL. Mm-hmm. Excuse me. And all the networks here in Philadelphia were just playing videos of Dick back in the day in 76, 7, 8, 9. Dick is such he, – he's, he's really intense when he gets up there and speaks. But, but when you're with him, you know, he's calm. He's really loving. He, you know, he's got his wine. I, my wine cooler is right there. I've got 10 bottles of Vermeil wine right there. You know, and I hear it's and, good. Yeah, and he's and it's good. Yeah, it's out there in Calistoga, you know, and, and mm-hmm. some Napa wine. It, it's pretty good. He is the nicest, calmest, the sweetest man in the world. But man, he was an animal back then. But you know what? I was too as a coach. And and I loved it. And you know, these guys, because that's the way my high school coaches were. That's the way my junior high school coaches were. There were no safety zones. You know, if you didn't, if you didn't, if you didn't make the play, and you're you're getting reamed out in front of 80, 60, 70 guys in, in the meeting room, there's no corner for you to go and suck your thumb or start, you know, doing. We don't have, we didn't have any of those zones. You know, and, right. and that's the way it should be. I mean, it's a contact. It's a violent sport, and you got to be able to sift out those. You know, and. He uh, he worked us harder than anybody, and uh, I, you know, but for me that that was the way I liked it to be, and and uh, right. I survived. So so but he's pretty God tough. Bless, God bless Dick for me, and what an honor it was for our family, my family, to go out to Canton, Ohio, with Dick for me, and we saw him before the ceremonies, walking through the walking through the hall because we were going to go to the Hall of Fame game, and we saw him. Just by accident in the hallways, I have this great picture. He hugged me. I'm going to tell you, Tony, he hugged me and wouldn't let me go for about a minute. And he just, you know, he just like, oh, it was. Oh, one of, I'm, I get goose pimples now. Bring me to tears. I, I bet you do. I, I just, you know, and I wish my dad could be here. My mom could be. My mom was a great athlete. And, uh, you know, I wish they could be here to see this and see our children and uh, and be a part of all this. What what a what a journey and what a what a life I have now as a result of all that it would have been okay i would have been an educator which is just great sure and this is taking it to a whole new level just talking to you and hanging with your son oh thank you very much <laughs>